trying to do is play hard here, run through the tape, be professional to close out their final couple of ball games. That's a good sign for the Clippers, another three. Well, you can run through the tape with that all day and all night with Paul George by Arco and, of course, Paul George on getting the party started. They want to get through this season, figure out what they're going to do next year, coaching-wise, whatever it may be, but they feel they're in a really good position for the ball. The Clippers in a good position with a 7-0 start, look very good. Offense is the reason why you see this starting lineup out there and looking good early. Paul George created an opportunity, big suit, throw it down, big fella. Can they win yeah. together yet to be seen? Well, but also, too, beautiful pass by Paul. That fits beautiful. together, <laughs> and those two can win together. Watch Paul George off the pick and roll, kind of a look away. Trey Lyles late to the party. But again, that extra dribble, Brian, and the organization, to figure this thing out and kind of get some stabilization. George on the wing for three. It is good. And uh, this right. just in, breaking news. Right. So is he. 17 for Paul George. George. What a pass. What a shot. Second three for Kennard, the third by 20. And uh, well, since the turn of the calendar, essentially, they are the best offense in the NBA. Although the Clippers tonight making a run at it, they have been very impressive. Another feed from Paul George. Now and trying to figure out the starting lineup and why they're playing well together. You want to continue to keep that rhythm as you move forward the next week. There we go. There we go, Guzzo. A three. You know, he, he gathered himself and went off two. And that threw all the rhythm off. That's why he missed it. Should have just went off one. Why it through the air with ease? He's done it again. Paul George drives, kicks it over. Norman Powell knocks in the three. I mean, that sounds 